Boston at the Blue Jackets. Patrice Bergeron. I'm settling on Patrice, Patrice Bergeron for an assist at plus 110. Columbus absolutely laid a dud versus the Coyotes the other day. Wow. Probably one of the worst duds of the year. They allowed two power play goals and six opportunities. Now they face the best power play unit that has Brad Marchand back. Went three for six last night versus Detroit, but they were up by so much. So the top six guys, they got a bit of a breather there in the third period. Bergeron has his winger back who had two goals last night. To you, Carlo, the Bruins have looked great out of the gates. How does getting Marshawn back affect this team in the locker room first off? Yeah. And then it trickles towards, obviously, familiarity on the power play and top line. Well, it definitely adds an added boost um, <laughs> to their lineup that's already played, you know, I think over expectations, at least from what most, most people predicted you're going to get out of the Boston. I mean, they're 7-1 and one to start the season. They lead the league in points with 14. They are the best team in the NHL, and like you like you mentioned, they just got back one of the best players in the game, and Marchand. Yeah. Now the only thing that I question here, and I believe it was their coach Jim Montgomery yesterday before the game mentioned when it was a surprise to everybody that Marchand was returning, I think a month earlier than expected, is that he won't be playing in back to back games. So I don't think he'll be in the lineup tonight. But I don't think it matters. I mean, the Boston Bruins have won six games without him in the lineup, and they're still scoring a ton of goals, and and. It almost seems like Bergeron has found a, a newfound life, you know, with the energy that he's playing with and the pace that he's playing at. And, and maybe it's because he's not playing with such a big contract on his back anymore. He's playing for, you know, a team friendly contract. But regardless, he's still averaging a point a game. Yeah, Marshawn in there would have been a boost, but this Boston team just knows how to get the job done. They really do, regardless of who's in or who's out. I mean, seven and one. Without Marshawn or McAvoy in the lab, who would have ever predicted that? Right. So that's why you got to love everything about what this Boston team is and what they represent. I mean, considering the injuries and the coaching change they made, most people thought that this was going to be a rebuilding year for them. Yeah, good luck convincing that locker room uh, yeah. about buying into a rebuild mode. And Patrick Bergeron is one of the biggest reasons why. I mean, you got that guy back. There's no way he's going to accept anything but winning. And – you know, considering what Columbus went through last game against Arizona, this is probably a game where they're probably going to be better in their performance, but they're still giving up a ton of chances and a ton of goals against. And it'll be hard for them to stop any of the top players in the Boston Bruins. So at plus money and for an assist, giddy up.